god oh my god oh my god oh my god i am speechless oh my god all i can say is oh my god we need to unbox this got a lovely little vanity case what is in here i have a feeling i know oh yes so we have a full size of jimmy choo i want you forever that is so stunning like look at this bottle this is one of my favorite fragrances like of all time and the fact that i now have it in full size because i had it in mini to test out but i now have it in full size is just the dream and the fact that they have made the bottle like black and gold oh i just love it like you know i love a little bit of like pink and gold and that is like my daytime vibes but this is like my nighttime scent and it is so delicious. It is absolutely beautiful. I literally cannot wait to wear it this evening. What is around here? Ooh. <gasps> Ooh, wow. Oh my gosh. This bathroom is just incredible. Can you hear the lovely sounds of Paris? Oh my goodness. Ugh. Oh. This is like bathroom of dreams. And look at this view. How stunning. So imagine someone like lives there. Oh, imagine having a cute little balcony like that. That is just the dream. I can't believe I'm staying here. I'm literally so over the moon. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. I think we need to unbox these. Oh. Please excuse my makeup. It was done at 6 a.m. this morning. We had a 5.45 wake up call and I've actually never jumped out of bed so fast. I was so excited. I am looking a little bit worse for wear in terms of the makeup, but it's fine because I'm about to redo it all. I'm about to get ready for a night out with Jimmy Choo. We are here to celebrate. Jimmy Choo, I Want You Forever. If you know, you know, Jimmy Choo, I Want You is one of my favorite fragrances. It is my ultimate like girls night out fragrance. I don't, I'm not gonna make any bold claims yet, but the new one might be my new favorite. It may have just, like they're both so stunning, but it may have just topped the original, but I'm not sure. I'm gonna see how I go over time. But Jimmy Choo, I Want You is like my ultimate girls night out fragrance. It's what I always wear and I always, love i love it so much like i smell it and it brings back like the most fun memories and that's like the best scent association for me i'm excited to make some new memories in a new fragrance and i'm so excited to be here in paris with jimmy Choo for the launch of this fragrance i actually smelled it in the summer i didn't realize but airports actually get the fragrance early and i'd smelt it like so much earlier this summer i smelt it in the airport and i absolutely loved it it's newly launched and i'm so so excited to be here celebrating it lots of you all know i'm so such a diehard Jimmy Choo fan so this is a, like a real dream come true and thank you to all of you for like supporting me over the years because um you guys really do help make my dreams come true and I love you very very much so thank you so much um but yeah I'm about to go and shoot with them I have a campaign to shoot with them whilst I'm here which I'm also equally over the moon about and yeah they've left me some bits in the room so i'm so excited to see what they are because like one of these boxes is big you guys it's so big like i have a pair of like these boots these boots which you will have seen a sneak peek of in the last vlog if you haven't seen it i will link it at the top of the screen basically a little bit of an unboxing a lot of me packing for paris it was basically just a week of me getting ready to come to paris and i showed you a little sneak peek of some of the shoes that i have for this trip that i bought in that video but yeah they have very kindly left me some things and this this box looks about the same size if not a little bit bigger than the box that my gorgeous teal boots came in so i'm so excited to see what that is but we're going to start off with my little vanity case which as you will have seen has the jimmy choo i want you fragrance in it i am obsessed and then there's a bit underneath so i'm gonna see what's in there so we have a lipstick i think this vanity case is gonna be so useful like it's huge this is the kind of makeup bag i need in my life lots of you will know if you have watched like the vlogs and stuff my makeup bag is always overflowing it never does up i really do need a big like old vanity case like this so this is probably the dream gift for me oh my god it actually has a little compartment bit underneath if you flip it and it's got like 
sections. Oh my god, I love that so much. Oh, oh my god, it's a tiny mini. Oh my god, so cool. Okay, so you can fill it up. Oh my god, I love that. That is amazing. I'm gonna always have I want you on me. And then these are the lipsticks, I believe. Oh, that is gorgeous. Love the vanity case, obsessed. So, so excited about the fragrance, like full size. Love that. And we have the little bag. You know I love a pair of sunnies. This packaging as well is stunning. Jimmy Choo packaging is my, I think my all time favorite packaging. I have been eyeing these up. They're actually slightly different, but I've been eyeing up this style. Oh my God. Maybe slightly crazy on me, but I don't even, oh my God, they're so fun. I am giving the ultimate Emily in Paris vibes right now. Sorry, I'm really hyper. This is gonna be borderline like the world's most irritating vlog to watch. I'm so aware, but I'm just so excited. I'm just so excited to be here. I think I might cry. Do you know what, during lockdown, <laughs> God, <laughs> this is when I start crying in Paris. During lockdown, I was genuinely so like coming to Paris was one of the things that I missed the most. It was one of the things I talked about doing the most and I just hadn't been back since lockdown eased, but I was so, it was one of the things, it was all I wanted to do. I've just realized I can see the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> what is happening? I'm just gonna put the sunglasses on because I'm like going to cry. Oh my God, that is so magical. I'm gonna show you in a minute. But yeah, all I wanted to do was come to Paris. Like there was a, of time during lockdown where all I was watching was like things set in Paris. I am gonna be so annoying, but I'm just so excited to be here. So apologies in advance and thank you for sticking with me if you make it to the end of this vlog because um, I may be a bit hyper right now, but I'm just basically, I'm gonna be really honest with you. Sorry, my hair is, <laughs> the, the bangs just ruin sunglasses hair. I was having a little bit of a cry recently where I just really felt like I wasn't good at what I did anymore I was just really struggling I remember sitting at my desk being like I just I'm not like my content isn't good what I do isn't good I'm not really very good at this anymore I should just stop and I, like I was beating myself up because I wasn't really like doing sorry I wasn't really doing very much in terms of like going places and doing all the things and and I was really being quite hard on myself and I was beating myself up and then literally I was like right I'm just gonna get out of this funk my number one way to get out of a funk take a shower I took a shower washed my hair always leaves me feeling fresh I get out of the shower and there is the email about this trip in my phone this is a good like couple of months back and I see this email in my phone and it's the invite for this trip and my response is literally I will be there with shoes on like I'm so buzzing about it I immediately am like crying and literally Ryan simultaneously knocks at the door and I'm like in my dressing gown and like little head towel crying and he's like what is wrong with you <laughs> and I'm just like I'm going to Paris with Jimmy Choo and I can't even say that without actually welling up because it just means so much to me to be on this trip because I don't know like just that it just just that little and they don't even know like but that little invite just really helped me and my confidence and I love I was so grateful to them for just that moment because that was like exactly what I needed at exactly the right time and I'm gonna put some last song because I'm actually gonna cry. But like this job is hard when you've been doing it for 10 years. This is like the most ridiculous way I've ever vlogged, like I'm crying with sunglasses on. This job is hard when you've been doing it for 10 years and there's so many people that are so amazing at what they do and you really struggle with like comparing yourself to have like a brand that you love so passionately invite you. It just, it meant everything. And especially just at that exact moment in time, it was just like a sign for me that was like, you are, you can do this, you are good enough. And yeah, so basically that is why I am so like ecstatic to be here right now because I really, I was really struggling. This just came at the perfect time and I'm just so, so grateful to be here. So I just wanna say thank you to the Jimmy Choo team for inviting me. And thank you to you guys for being great. I love you so, so much. Thank you um, and for sticking with me. I just love you all very, very much, so. But yeah, anyway, so that was me unboxing the sunglasses and I've already cried, so we're gonna just, you know, I'm gonna hurry this up because I need to pee, 
so badly. Like I've literally just got in the room and I just need to pee and we need to hurry this up. So medium sized bag. What is it? Oh my God, that is the cutest little bag. Oh my God, it's like a little mini like vanity case. It's so cute. Oh, it's just the cutest thing I've ever seen. Like the actual cutest thing I've ever, ever, ever seen. Let's move on to the big box before I cry, but actually I may cry because I'm nervous. I'm so nervous. What's in here? overwhelmed <laughs> and when i get overwhelmed i just don't know what to do it's kind of paralyzing oh my god i need to know if they fit okay what do we think i think with this outfit it's a little bit weird but i think these could look amazing with like a little mini dress i have one that i was thinking of wearing this evening that i think these would look amazing with potentially Turnaround of my life, ready to shoot. Hi guys, I have not checked in in a while, but I did a little shoot with Jimmy Choo, which I cannot wait to show you. It was literally the most fun I have had in a very long time. We had a nice long lunch. I have just shot some photos of Chloe. I've got the girls here. Hello, oh my God, this light is good. You look glowy. Oh. It's been so nice hanging out with you guys. I'm really, I'm really oh, enjoying sure. myself. I'm having so the best cute. time. Um, you. You. Literally love it, and we're all sparkly. Oh, Amelia, yeah. this oh, eye makeup. Tonight, oh. though, that's the question. Yeah. I, is that a question? Is that a, does that? Are you on the wine or the cocktails? Oh. What? I'm feeling wine. No, I hadn't okay. even thought about it because I just mm. thought I need to finish my my <laughs> reel. <laughs> Thinking about but work. it's done now. Work is over. <laughs> We're in Paris. We are just on our way to dinner. Actually, where are we going for dinner? Does anyone know? It's a very good question. We're just getting driven. We don't know. <laughs> it's a mystery. Um, but I'm very excited to eat some good food. I'm excited to eat some bread. I abstain from the bread at lunch, you guys. So I'm excited for that. Mm, it's going to be so good. So I will check in with you in a little it's bit. It's le boeuf sans le toit. Which means... Does that mean like the beef on the on the oh, I don't know what that means. <laughs> oh my god you guys, this is our dinner location. This is, hello! Oh, oh can we also just hello honey hello. this <laughs> is the dress oh my god this is this is stunning wow bonsoir oh my god bonsoir wow look at those lights Day 
to in Paris. I promise I'm going to try and be better at vlogging today because I feel like I was a bit pansy yesterday. Sometimes it's just quite overwhelming when you get somewhere new and there's so many people and there's a lot to be doing and all the photos to take and I just can't do everything. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to today. I think it's gonna be a really fun day. We are just about to go out and do a little bit of sightseeing, take some pics before lunch. I just had a delicious breakfast, had Alvo toast, it was unreal. And really beautiful as well, but I just completely forgot to bring my vlogging camera, which was not good. That was not the good attempt at vlogging that I had planned for today, but hopefully it'll be better from here on out. I'm actually just gonna do a little bit of speed makeup before we go out and shoot. I literally have 15 minutes to get ready, so wish me luck. Little outfit of the day. So we have Jimmy Choo Sunnies, which I'm obsessed with. I love them so much. I had seen these in all the campaign imagery and I'm obsessed with them. Me and Nuri swapped. She is an angel. She wanted mine. I wanted hers. Match made in heaven. And then I have a Jacquemus shirt on, which you may have seen in my last vlog. I love this. I really love the way the fabric falls. I feel like it's very flattering on me and I normally really struggle with a white shirt. So this is like my perfect kind of oversized slouchy white shirt. It's like that nice combo of both slouchy and not slouchy. And then I've got some like trouser leggings on, which are quite old from Zara. Jimmy Choo teal boots. And then this little bag. And then my rings are Monica Vinida and Edge of Ember on this hand. And then I have Monica Vinida and Raimi on this hand. And I'm not wearing my big gold earrings today because last night when I was shooting they were really doing me dirty and they were like prying my hair into like weird like there'd just be a sliver that would be in front of the earring and the rest of it was behind and it just looked terrible so we're going earringless today. Speed makeup went okay. Went okay. Yeah I am gonna go downstairs. We're gonna go out see Perry, shoot some pics. I'm so excited. Oh, it's the most gorgeous day today. Like, look, look at this. <gasps> ah, my God, literally the most stunning view ever. Little fragrance touch up. Mm. Delish, delish. Also, if you know, you know, I'm wearing this blush today, just a little bit. Alana, if you're watching this, this is your doing and I love you and I miss you and I'm glad all of you really enjoyed the uh, French Chateau vlog and which was mainly just us getting ready together. Uh, thank you all so much for the lovely comments on that one. I'm so glad you all enjoyed it. Um, I want to rope someone else in to come and do their makeup with me whilst I'm on this trip. I feel like that would be really fun. I miss Get Ready With Me so much. One outfit change later, courtesy of this one. We've got our picks. <laughs> We're going to lunch. We have arrived at lunch. My gorgeous date. My little speed date. Always. Sante. This is when I'm saying it wrong, but. Yeah. It's honestly, the bow is live. The bow is live. I'm obsessed with it. J'adore le frit. Oh my god. You guys, look at these desserts. Oh. I have FOMO. I have dessert FOMO. Stunning. Superb. So, Susie, where are we going? Pastry. That I can't eat, but that's fine. It's okay. I'm gonna be that TikTok that's like, I can't eat this, but yeah. How great is it to smell it? I'll eat it. I'll eat them. Yeah. I'll do a taste test. Yeah, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Perfect, perfect. So Susie, talk us through what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> right, what are we doing next? 
Now um, you want to try to put the food uh, in the pate uh, magnet? Yeah, sure. You make some pastries at home? Never. Never? Never was your cut. Otherwise, you end up with squatting out all over the place. You can't eat it. like it is going to be incredible and it is now what time is it like 8 50 8 50 this is way past my dinner time guys i've annihilated a pack of vegan marylands it was Wait, incredible can we talk about the lighting that i'm giving her oh yeah right sorry now? clarice doesn't realize that i am just giving her the best lighting I'm her the assistant. monologue that i'm giving and she's like yeah it's fine just my arm's just about to drop off but we're fine they're like hang on can you light yourself because yeah her gorgeous face this is my i love her so much Aww, she's my birthday yeah. twin my fellow libra queen I'm just holding this light it's so weird. <laughs> hi susie's followers this is chloe you need to go and follow her if you don't already because i, I am don't obsessed. have youtube though, i'm obsessed I'm with like, her no but like instagram channel. and can you yeah can you tell her if you want her to get a youtube channel because i really want her to get a youtube channel i think i'd be your biggest fan Aww, i just said like a hundred words <laughs> in the space light. of like two seconds we are on our way to dinner i am so excited i don't even care what the dinner is you guys like i will I will eat all of the food. I don't care what it is. I'm starving. But um, yeah, I think it's going to be a really nice evening. So let's go. Let's feed me. You have a very tired girl on your hands because I was up so late last night editing. I was up until two and I feel like my eyeballs are gonna fall out of my face, but it's all good. I'm going for breakfast now and I'm gonna take you with me because the breakfast here is so good. I think I forgot to say yesterday, but the hotel we're staying at is Hotel Madame Reeve. I think that's how you say it, or Reeve. Not sure, but it's beautiful. Really, really beautiful. I would definitely look into staying here when I come to Paris next. It's really, really gorgeous and the rooms are just so lovely like this ceiling like all the windows i'm just obsessed i love like big big windows and feeling like i have the outdoors indoors kind of vibe it's my favorite thing so um yeah big fan of the rooms here and the breakfast and the overall hotel as well is just stunning but yeah i need to go to breakfast and then i need to pack this look at this not cute it's not cute but first Food. My avocado oh, toast, no, you guys. This is like avocado no. toast of my dreams. The breakfast here is so good. And they've got a little almond milk iced latte. Okay, so we are doing speed makeup because I spent too long talking at breakfast. Uh, so the Jimmy Choo team, classic Sue's move there. Uh, everyone else is like, I'm gonna have breakfast in the room and get stuff done. And it's just not within my capabilities, so. I spent too long talking and now I have about 10 minutes to get ready. Starting off with concealing as always. I think I'm just going to go for light makeup today. I don't know if I'm going to be shooting anything to be honest. So I think I'm going straight from lunch to Garden North. So yeah, we're just going to basically do a full face of concealer. I have to say, I left my NARS, what is it, L light reflecting foundation at home and i have never regretted anything so much yes it requires a lot of powder however it looks incredible in real life whereas i have been using i don't know if it's here been using the charlotte tilbury magic foundation which i used to use all the time and it does look incredible on camera in person just does not have the same pizzazz it's much drier it's definitely more of a summer foundation but i just didn't really want to have to carry my powder everywhere with me and to be fair it's been very warm and my makeup did not move so swings and roundabouts but i'm excited to get back home to my like lovely creamy nars foundation I had to shoot again 
last night with the Jimmy Choo team. So I didn't really get the chance to vlog a lot. I was hoping we'd get the chance to catch up and it just didn't really happen. But we had the most amazing dinner after I finished shooting um, and I had the most amazing time shooting. I love working with like a full team it's always the most fun but yeah dinner was like a jacket potato like a baked jacket potato with uh like truffle on it and i feel like it was caviar and truffle and that wasn't what i wanted but <laughs> it was great nonetheless it was at a place called caspia i think very very nice and they had this like little band that came in and i have never you'll have to go over to vic and alex's vlogs i feel like alex maybe had quite a fair bit of footage of me like i was literally in my element it was amazing i loved every second of it but we didn't go to dinner it was very european of us we didn't go to dinner until about 10 was it 10 o'clock we definitely didn't sit down until 10 o'clock it's a very very late dinner and therefore a very very late bedtime and I still had some work to do last night as well. So I went to bed at like 2.30. I'm going to absolutely annihilate a Domino's vegan pepperoni, if you know, you know, <laughs> when I get home. I've had the best time. I, I always look forward to being home because I just love being home. I'm a home bunny, but I actually don't want to leave. Like this has just been the most fun. I've loved every second of it, but fortunately I'm not going home yet. Still got one more lunch. Okay, I am ready for the day in Paris or the rest of the day or half my day. Thank you so much for getting ready with me. Thank you for coming along for this episode of Susie in Paris. Honestly, I wish I could have showed you the outtakes because that was some terrible French. Like you think Emily in Paris is bad, I'm a hundred times worse. Anyway, yeah, I have thoroughly enjoyed my time here. So we're gonna go enjoy the rest of the day and yeah, I'll see you guys a little bit later. and the Uggs and a plain white t-shirt. This is me done. I'm in my pajamas for the next three days. 